So, um, in Caves of Fuck, the joke on the island is just an additional thought would be that there's a tiger that's loose that even the mercenaries that they uh, hired to get them there are afraid of. And they say that they don't know, like, how long it's been a loose on Madagascar or how it got there. But it's supposedly, you know, real sexual. And it, uh, you know, doesn't uh, exactly kill people. So, you know, it's just a rapist tiger on the loose is the joke. <laughs> you know, I was thinking that the uh, job that he gets because... Uh, you know, he changes his modeling career slightly in uh, the uh, third movie would be he uh, gets a bunch of contracted jobs for uh, backpack modeling, you know, shirtless backpack runway modeling. <laughs> this is hilarious. Is and he has funny. like tribal Native American paint on at some of the scenes and like face paint of like different things, yeah, like jungle he's, stuff. He's, like, and things. It's because there's so many backpacks released every year that it yeah. could actually be feasibly logical. It'd be cool. Makes sense. Yeah, my brother came up with most of it, but uh, we had a further idea for the uh, dream sequence. <laughs> That, you know, it's all smoky everywhere, like, you can't see much as if the enemies are mostly not seen and disappearing and reappearing out of all that smoke and dust, of course. And then off in the distance, you know, he, uh, Brad Pitt calls in a uh, airstrike on the uh, jihadist palace and you see it blow up from a distance and he says it's made out of compressed uh, goat's milk into cubes because it's the ultimate jihadist luxury in the desert because, uh, you know, it never rains. And then all the powdered goat's milk blows up and, uh, you know, it's like blows on the breeze as they start coughing on it. Yeah.